Hey guys, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Canvas and Scal Help on Facebook. Had a couple questions about the set mask, clip mask, basically uh, the mask functions that can be utilized right here, the clipping paths and also up here objects, uh, clip path, clip mask, okay? Um, remember, when we use the Scan and Cut, because that's the only machine I have, that's the only machine I teach, um, we do not have drivers. So, how Sure Cuts a Lot is built, it is built for cutters. Well, it is not necessarily built for only the scan and cut. So, sometimes maybe there might be extra features in there that maybe some of the larger cutters can use that we really can't access, okay? Maybe there's another feature in there that we should be accessing instead of, okay? Like this one, all right? So, I just typed out some... Uh, love okay um i don't have it grouped or anything like that but let's go ahead i'm going to come in here and i'll just go ahead and group it okay just so that it stays together it's a little easier for me we're going to come over here and we're going to put this on top of okay now if i leave it just like that come over here you can't hang on okay so now i can come over here let's try path okay that's what that does Let's try mask. Doesn't do anything to the word because the word lies in front of. Okay. Oops. Let's turn it. Let's click on this little guy and get put that to none. Okay. Let's grab this heart. Range. Bring him to the front. Okay. So what if I set mask? Oops. What if I set mask here? Okay, doesn't really do anything. Okay, <clears throat> let's select both of them. Aha! Now let's go to it. Let's do the path first. Okay, that's what it does. It kind of gives you a jumbled mess because of the lines that cross, it hollows them out. Okay, I will show you what this looks like because isn't that a beautiful thing right there, right? Okay, this is exactly what it looks like when it gets to the scan and cut, okay? Everything is separate, okay? All your love, each letter is separate. There's no uh, cut line that goes through that, okay? I will actually show you what it looks like when it gets to the scan and cut. Okay, okay so, so I just, I just sent it over, over here with, with my, my USB, USB cord. cord. All right, so, so that's what it looks like. like. Let me get my big old fat hand out of the way. Okay, so there's the whole heart. Okay, and here's each little letter. So basically, it did nothing. Okay, didn't do a dead gum thing. Okay, so let's shut this off and go back to the machine. Okay, so we've seen that that file was kind of just a general send it over like it looks type of file there was no special effects applied to it okay even though it's still highlighted again you can come in here and you can try break apart well that doesn't really do anything either to help us okay um nothing really is going to work okay come up here object clip path okay so that's what that one was Let's undo that. Okay, let's undo. Let's see, is it still joined together? All is one. Nope, good. Okay. So let's come back out here to object and we'll do the mask. Set mask. Okay. Gives us a really pretty lighter color. Okay, so that the fonts were in black, so it gives us a lighter black, which is gray. Okay. When I send this over to the machine, I will get the exact same thing, okay? That, this, exact same thing is going to come up. We're still going to have each individual letter and the heart. It is not going to look anything like that, okay? Again, our machine is not powered by a driver from Sure Cuts A Lot, okay? If you want this look in a file, what you should do is this right here okay let me make sure that this is ungrouped is it yes okay 
Okay, remember your path has to have two pieces, so I know that it's two. Don't want back minus front or front minus back. What we want to do is an intersection. That keeps what intersects here. That gives us the exact same look. If we want it to cut like that, now when I send this to the machine, that is exactly what I'm going to look, uh, what it's going to look like. If I want it to be joined, okay, I'm going to come into path union and that's going to join any of those crossed cut lines. So let's take a preview. Much nicer, okay. So that's what we as scan and cutters are going to use if we want that look, okay. However, if you like, let me see if I can undo out of here. Okay, one more, one more, maybe. Oh, good Lord, no, it's just going to take me right on out, isn't it? Yep, okay. So let's say, let me bring this heart to the front. Come on, come on. Okay, so let's say we want the mask. We want this look right here, okay? This is a printable. This is something that we could print, okay? That's the only way that we can use this. All right, guys? Hopefully this helps you understand that and why it wasn't a huge thing for me to talk about because it really doesn't serve us as we use our scan and cut any purpose, okay, that I have found. Every time I send things to the machine, test them out, this doesn't do anything but come up exactly like it shows in the black lines, all right? exactly like it shows in the preview that's why when you start to learn uh shortcuts lot always use that preview it's not going to lie it's going to show you exactly what's going to happen okay all right if you have any further questions please find me over at scan and cut canvas and scal help on facebook thanks guys